America has been secretly flying the world's most lethal fighter jet for five years, while the entire world thought China was winning the sixth generation arms race. How did the Pentagon pull off the biggest aviation cover-up in modern history, while Beijing celebrated their prototype reveals? Smash that subscribes button immediately, because the classified details we're about to reveal will completely rewrite everything you know about air superiority. The Ghost Program's Origins The F-47 NGAD didn't emerge from thin air in 2025. Its roots stretch back to a classified DARPA initiative launched in 2014 that operated under budget line items so obscure that even congressional oversight committees couldn't track the spending. Boeing constructed full-scale demonstrators at a secret facility in Palmdale, California, where engineers worked in compartmentalized teams, each knowing only their specific component to prevent leaks. By 2019, these experimental aircraft were conducting night flights over restricted Nevada ranges, testing propulsion systems that generated 45% more thrust than anything flying today. The program burned through an estimated $28 billion in black budget funding before a single public announcement was made. But here's what makes this truly extraordinary. The Air Force was simultaneously running decoy programs with Lockheed Martin, to throw off foreign intelligence agencies, making everyone believe the competition was still wide open when Boeing had already locked in a five-year technological lead. The Beijing panic response. China's December 2024 fighter reveal wasn't a demonstration of strength. It was a desperate reaction to intelligence reports, confirming America's secret testing program had succeeded beyond their worst nightmares. Chinese military leadership accelerated their J-36 and J-50 programs by forcing both prototypes into premature public flights, risking catastrophic failures just to show they hadn't been left behind completely. The timing on Mao's birthday was deliberate psychological warfare, but Western intelligence analysts noticed something crucial. Both Chinese aircraft used interim engines rated at only 65% of their design specifications because their advanced engine program had failed critical durability tests. Beijing's own military journals published concerns that their fighter prototypes wouldn't achieve true operational capability until 2035 at the earliest, a full six years after America's F-47 reaches initial deployment. The Chinese Defense Ministry requested an emergency budget increase of $47 billion specifically for sixth-generation development, revealing just how far behind they'd fallen. What they still don't know is that the F-47's most revolutionary capability isn't the airframe at all. It's something far more dangerous that redefines the very concept of air combat. Why America Built This the F-47 exists because Pentagon war games conducted in 2018 revealed a terrifying reality. America would lose air superiority over Taiwan within 96 hours of a Chinese invasion using only current generation fighters. Simulation after simulation showed that China's numerical advantage of 1,800 combat aircraft versus America's 450 forward-deployed fighters in the Pacific would overwhelm even the technological superiority of F-22s and F-35s through sheer mass. The tyranny of distance problem meant that every American sortie required vulnerable tanker aircraft that Chinese long-range missiles could eliminate in the war's opening minutes, effectively grounding the entire fleet. Air Force Chief of Staff General Charles Brown testified in classified hearings that without a revolutionary capability leap, America faced a 73% probability of losing air dominance in any Western Pacific conflict by 2030. The F-47 NGAD program received emergency funding authorization because it solved all three critical failures simultaneously, range, lethality, and the ability to fight outnumbered. But the real breakthrough that justified the $185 million per aircraft cost wasn't just better performance, it was a completely new way of fighting that turns numerical disadvantage into irrelevance. The Range Revolution The F-47's combat radius of 1,200 nautical miles doesn't just exceed current fighters, it fundamentally restructures American military geography across the Pacific theater. 
This range allows F-47s stationed at Anderson Air Force Base in Guam to reach targets along China's coast without refueling, eliminating the vulnerability window that tanker aircraft create during conventional operations. For comparison, an F-35A maxes out at 670 nautical miles combat radius, meaning it requires mid-air refueling for any meaningful Pacific mission, while the older F-22 manages only 590 nautical miles before needing gas. The F-47 achieves this extended range through adaptive cycle engines that dynamically adjust their bypass ratio during flight, operating in high efficiency mode during transit, and switching to maximum thrust only during combat engagement. These engines also generate 1.5 megawatts of onboard electrical power, enough to run a small town which feeds the aircraft's energy-hungry directed energy weapons and electronic warfare systems. What makes this capability truly revolutionary is that the F-47 can maintain supersonic crews at Mach 1.8 across these distances without afterburners, arriving over target with full weapon loads and enough fuel reserves for extended loitering or combat maneuvering that would leave adversaries struggling just to reach the battlefield. The sensor fusion dominance. The F-47's sensor suite represents a $4.2 billion standalone development program that processes data from 17 different sensor types simultaneously, creating a battlefield picture so detailed that pilots can identify specific aircraft models at ranges exceeding 400 miles. This sensor-to-shooter compression reduces the kill chain from detection to weapon impact to under eight seconds for air-to-air -air engagements faster than enemy pilots can even recognize they're under attack. The aircraft's AN-APG-85 radar operates across multiple frequency bands simultaneously, making it impossible for adversaries to jam without revealing their exact location which the F-47's AI immediately converts into targeting data. Infrared search and track systems detect heat signatures against the cold background of high altitude with such sensitivity that they can spot enemy aircraft by their thermal bloom alone, even through clouds and at night when radar stealth is most effective. The distributed aperture system provides 360-degree situational awareness with no blind spots, projecting threat information directly onto the pilot's helmet display so they never lose track of adversaries maneuvering behind them. But the most classified aspect is the AI co-pilot system that predicts enemy movements 12 seconds into the future based on flight dynamics analysis, giving F-47 pilots what amounts to tactical precognition in dogfights. The drone swarm integration. Each F-47 commands up to six collaborative combat aircraft that cost $30 million each versus the $185 million manned fighter, allowing America to deploy numerical superiority while risking only unmanned assets in the most dangerous missions. These AI-powered drones carry specialized payloads, some loaded with AIM-260 long-range missiles others equipped with electronic attack packages that can jam entire enemy air defense networks, and dedicated reconnaissance variants that push 200 miles ahead of the manned fighter to map threats. The control architecture allows the F-47 pilot to assign targets and mission parameters, while the drone's onboard AI handles the tactical execution, including autonomous threat evasion formation flying through adverse weather, and even ammunition management to ensure they don't waste missiles on low-value targets. In recent classified exercises, single F-47 formations with drone wingmen achieved kill ratios of 28 to 1 against simulated enemy fighters, completely overwhelming adversary tactics designed around traditional force packages. The Stealth Technology Leap the F-47's radar cross-section measures smaller than 0.0001 square meters, roughly the size of a marble compared to the F-22's golf ball signature and the F-35's baseball, making it effectively invisible to even the most advanced Chinese and Russian radar systems until it closes within 15 miles. This Stealth Plus capability comes from metamaterial skin panels, that actively adapt their electrical properties in microseconds to absorb incoming radar waves across multiple frequency bands simultaneously, including low-frequency radars that previously could detect stealth aircraft. 
The aircraft's thermal management system routes engine heat through the wing structure before venting it through thousands of micro perforations, cooling the exhaust signature to near ambient temperature and defeating infrared search systems that Russia and China rely on for stealth detection. Even the F-47's paint contains carbon nanotubes that convert radar energy into heat, which the thermal management system then disperses, creating a closed-loop stealth system that actually gets harder to detect the more intensely enemies try to illuminate it. The F-47 NGAD isn't just another fighter jet, it's America's insurance policy for the next 50 years of air dominance. While adversaries burn billions trying to catch up to technology we've already perfected. If this opened your eyes to what's really happening in modern military aviation, slam that like button and subscribe so you never miss our next breakdown. Drop a comment telling us which F-47 capability shocked you most, and check out our next video where we reveal the classified weapons system that makes this fighter truly unstoppable.